welcome to another video in this system of equations uh, the combination of factorial and uh, let's say the exponential equations and we want to find the x but the problem is this two factorial all right let's see how to solve this suppose we have uh, six factorial and this one is in a bracket you know we have factorial in a bracket and other factorial outside the bracket so this one it means six factorial itself is 720 then um multiplying another factorial so for this case uh 720 factorial is 720 um you know we'll be subtracting one dot 719 and that is how it will be going till uh it reach like um two then to zero factorial which is one that is for the case of when we have uh, two factorial where well, one is in bracket and the other one is outside the bracket but the one we are giving there is nothing like bracket there so both of them they stay together so without bracket and it is six factorial factorial so for this case it means that we are going to be um multiplying six by four and uh, we are multiplying this as uh, another two so that is for the case of when two factorial stay and let's check another one when we have three factorials and this one means we are multiplying six by three and that is how it will be going all right so depend on the number of factorials unlike the one that has bracket or the one that has just only one factorials all right um yeah, the given question is 3 raised to the power x uh, equals to 6 factorial factorial and we have derived this 6 factorial factorial that is um, 48 and uh, for this 48 we are going to replace it in where we have 6 factorial then we have 6 factorial equals to 48 all right i think we have gotten uh, away with factorials then uh, this 48 is 3 multiplied by 16 and 16 is 2 raised to the power of 4 and if I divide both sides by 3 dividing both sides by 3 2 then we have these two cancelled and this one becomes 3 raised to the power of x minus 1 equals to 2 to the power of 4 so the next thing I'm going to do here is if I try to introduce logarithm so just to cut the method short we still have another way of doing this but let's introduce logarithm to get the quick answers so we have ln of 3 to the power of x minus 1 equals to ln 2 raised to the power of 4 and this x minus 1 will come down then we have x minus 1 bracket ln of 3 equals to 4 ln 2 then we divide 2 by ln of 3 so we want to have x minus 1 separate and here we have this will go then x minus 1 equals to 4 ln 2 divided by ln 3 and uh, by adding 1 to both sides we have these two cancelled and uh, we have x equals to 4 ln 2 divided by ln 3 so this should be ln uh, yeah, so it's will be ln, then we divide by ln 3 plus 1. And there is value of x, or we can get the decimal value of this as it has been approximated to 3. Point, around 3.54 or let's say 52, something like that. Yeah. And this is how to solve this problem. Mm -hmm. I hope you get something, but if you have another way of doing this, you can drop it in the comment box and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and like this video so you can also share it i will really appreciate it thanks for watching never stop learning bye bye